Carl from Apt, and in this video I'll be going over the specs and features of the HWB450 soundbar from Samsung. This is their entry level soundbar for 2022, and it's a great way to upgrade your TV sound on a budget. If you're watching this on YouTube, be sure to like and subscribe to stay up to date on all of our newest products, and you can see our latest pricing on this soundbar or get in touch with one of our experts at the links down in the description. The HWB450 is 33.8 inches wide, 2.3 inches high, and 3 inches deep, and the included wireless subwoofer is 7.2 inches wide, 13.5 inches high, and 11.6 inches deep, making this a pretty compact system that will fit easily onto a stand or you can mount it on the wall with the included wall mounting kit. All the onboard controls are located on the top, and those include power, volume up and down, and source select. For connections, you get a USB for music playback, an optical input, and Bluetooth for wireless connectivity. However, with this being the most basic model, there's no HDMI connection. There aren't that many manual controls for the 450, but you do get several preset sound modes to choose from. There's bass boost to give you more low end, surround sound expansion to enhance the surround effects, game mode to help you hear the quieter details like footsteps approaching while you're gaming, standard, which turns off any of those additional enhancements, and adaptive light, which lets the soundbar determine what settings to use based on what's playing. It's also got auto AV sync, so the audio coming out of the soundbar matches up exactly with what's going on on the screen. To use any of these presets, you just hit the sound mode button on the included remote. Another handy feature of the HWB450 is the ability to add optional rear channel speakers. This one's gonna work with the SWA9100 or 9200S if you decide to add those. The HWB450 has 2.1 channels powered by a total of 300 watts, and as far as sound quality goes, it's an entry-level model, so you have to keep your expectations realistic, but it's certainly better than what you get from the speakers built into your TV. Dialogue comes through clearly, even with this only being two channels, and bass is decent as well. It's not earth-shaking, but it's enough to help bring out the booms and explosions that you might miss if you were just listening to your TV speakers. It's not really the most ideal model for music, but it's good enough that you wouldn't need to go out and buy a separate Bluetooth speaker for the same room. Plus, it's under $200, which makes this a really good value. The HWB450 is going to be an ideal soundbar for a casual movie viewer who wants to improve the audio on their TV without breaking the bank. It doesn't have a ton of bells and whistles, but the Bluetooth lets you connect to a compatible TV wirelessly, and the different sound profiles really do help enhance different types of content. If you do wind up going with this one, just make sure your TV has an optical audio output, as again, this one doesn't have HDMI, but that's also a part of the reason why it's so reasonably priced. If you have any questions on the HWB450 or need help finding the right soundbar for your home theater, please be sure to contact our experts. We're here seven days a week. If you don't live close enough to come see us in person at the store, you can also reach out to us by phone, email, or online chat. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.